Hello everyone, I'm Mike, KD2KOG, part of the technical support staff at SDR Play. In this video I will demonstrate the brand new function added to SDR Uno version 1.42 build 0817 and that is band framing customization. Preset band buttons have been part of SDR Uno since version 1.21 and now with build 0817 you can add up to 10 of your own preset buttons. The custom band buttons have specifics and I would like to point these out to you before we get started. High and low frequencies can be anywhere from 1 kHz to 2 GHz. The maximum frequency span is 10 MHz. The minimum frequency span is 62.5 kHz. Notch filters are not applied. Custom band framing is only supported in 0IF mode and not in low IF mode. For this reason, custom band framing is not supported in either diversity or master slave modes of the RSP Duo. I would also like to mention that many of the preset band buttons use low IF mode. So to go from preset framing to custom framing, you must unframe the, man, uh, the band and make sure zero IF mode is selected. A quick glance at the top right of the main panel will display which mode is selected. Resetting SDR Uno to default will clear all defined custom band buttons. Now I will show you how to create a custom band button. To create a custom band button, navigate to the RX control panel and verify a preset band button is not selected. If one is selected, Click the band button that is in use and unframe the band. Navigate to the main panel and see which IF mode is currently in use, low IF or zero IF. If the device is in low IF mode, switch to zero IF mode by pressing the IF mode button. Navigate back to the RX control panel and left click the red bands button. Select custom and right click the button you wish to customize. Enter in the low and high frequencies. Remember, maximum is 10 megahertz with a minimum of 62.5 kilohertz. Kilohertz and megahertz can auto complete trailing zeros by entering in the first number and pressing K for kilohertz or M for megahertz. Now give the band button a meaningful name up to four characters and click OK. Click the band button to enable it. And that's all there is to it. If you guys have any questions or comments regarding this video, please leave them in the comment section and I'll answer them as quickly as possible. Thank you so much for watching and 73.